I'm gonna start with a plane. I'm using cycles. Experimental. Just add the material. Also add a subdivision surface modifier. Select adaptive. Now in material properties, settings, in displacement, change to displacement and bump. Now in world properties, I'm gonna use a sky texture for lighting. In render properties, under subdivision, I'm gonna set preview render to 1.2 for better resolution. And now I can add a displacement node. Connect to displacement. Let's preview the render in displacement node. I'm gonna set level to zero and scale to 0.7 for now. Next, add a Voronoi texture. Connect distance into height. Change to 4D. Select smooth F1. In smoothness, we need a low value. I'm gonna use 0.088. You can play with the scale. Now in displacement node, I'm gonna lower the scale to 0.2. Select the bottom right texture and press Ctrl T. And now we need more randomness, so we can add a noise texture. Select the noise texture and mapping and press Ctrl-0 on the numpad to mix them. I can change the noise scale. Now in the mix node, use factor to mix the textures. Now I'm gonna add a Gabor texture. Select Gabor and Voronoi textures and press Ctrl-0. Now set Mix Node to Screen. Then increase the scale, for example 100. And now we use Factor to lower Texture Strength. We need a very low value. In Gabor Texture, we can change the orientation if needed. Now press Ctrl T. Delete this one and connect it to Vector. Then add a Noise Texture and press Ctrl 0 again. Now play with Factor to play with the Strength. I can increase the scale. Maybe we can increase the detail. Now in Voronoi texture, we can randomize the terrain with W value. And I want to add some mountains. Finally, to render the scene, I added two array modifiers. One for each axis.